Men can get breast cancer too, says New York City Councilman Andy King, proudly wearing pink at the Breast Cancer Walk kickoff breakfast at the Villa Barone in preparation for the walk held each year at Orchard Beach. He's launched a new initiative just in time to demonstrate that men are also at risk. Men have breasts too. And we forget, you know, when it comes to cancer, when we talk about men, you think of prostate, but there's so many men who are suffering from breast cancer and stuff. So we need to bring more awareness, tell our men to get checked as well, you know, get the service and come out of the shadows. If you are ill, there's support systems in place to help men who are struggling to try to identify because how can I get breast cancer? Among those at the dining hall, which turned into a sea of pink, 65-year-old Dolores Mitchell, a 24-year-old cancer survivor, there to remember those who lost the fight. I'm here to support the cause, help in any way I can. And she's not alone. I'm here today because breast cancer is a big issue and a concern for our community and for my family. My aunt, my two cousins, and my grandmother were all survivors, except my grandmother. She passed away a while back from cancer. So it's, it's a tragic episode to happen in anyone's life. So we need to support the cancer awareness throughout our whole borough and our whole city. Along with fundraising, senior marketing manager for the American Cancer Society, Lizette Dorado, says that with real men wearing pink in effect, she'd like to see more men involved. October 16th will be one of the most energetic, amazing days in Orchard Beach. We expect about 15,000 walkers, 500 survivors, um, about 40 pace setters who raise over $2,500, and they'll all be walking in celebration of their victory against breast cancer. Um, last year, we raised $625,000. This year, we hope to raise a lot more um, with the support of the community and our sponsors, and of course, the real men wearing pink who's in, uh, who signed on for this national campaign. So the next major event for this organization will be on October 16th for the Breast Cancer Walk on Orchard Beach. Last year they broke a record $625,000. This year they want to break that record. For BronxNet, this is Arlene Makoko.